Hello guys, welcome to another video of Tower Survivor. Hmm, <clears throat> sorry. So let's uh, get reload this uh, because uh, there's no um, gold or bounty hunter upgrades. Let's reload. Oh, we got transmute one of the best upgrades in this game. But I'm have doubt if I should pick this because we might not survive uh, the level one or level two creeps, uh, the early creeps. So I have my doubts. Mm, it's a hard decision, of course. But maybe let's try if we can survive this. I mean, even if we have to use clear, it's going to be worth it. I think. Maybe we can get a, a spec. Oh, we have to use clear. So let's see if we can survive this. Okay, another transmute. Are you killing me? Let's get as, as many 500 towers as possible because we want to survive the early rounds. Okay, seems like it's working. Let's get a regeneration and let's get this. I have steel. The problem is that I've got a, another transmute. I mean, what's happening in this game? First time seeing so many transmutes. And uh, it annoys me that uh, I cannot buy it. Because we have to survive first. Okay, now that I have, uh, I have some, some amount of gold, you do not give me any income upgrade. Maybe we should get uh, a splash here. Maybe not. Let's wait and see. To the repair crew. Okay, double bounty hunter. That's great. Let's get uh, another health stone. Look at how fast health stone can kill that. That gold wa wagons. Oh, it feels great. Okay, now we should uh, save some gold. So our income is actually great. I mean, we have the highest income among all the players. So that's a great indicator of our success. Uh, success. So let's get more income. Uh, let's get Shockwave. Shockwave is a great tower, especially if I see gold wagon coming in. We kind of want to kill the gold wagons because they give extra gold. So make sure you get any type of weapon that you are have available available at your hand to kill those wagons. Because if you kill all the wagons, if it will give you a lot of gold that is enough to compensate for the cost that you have invested. So we've got a other, another gold mine, and let's get a magic claw. Let's reroll. Let's get a little more specs and see if uh, maybe we can combine specs with uh, active weapons. That's a new strategy because I used to buy only active weapons and not passive specs. So let's get more specs and uh, jump of uh, 
power is pretty interesting. We might get that. Mm, I'm thinking if I should get this, the, this uh, 2000 gold specs. Because the other towers, other weapons are not interesting. But we, sh we should get a gem of power, that's for sure. Because combined with magic coin, wow, that's it, magic coin, it's a great, it's a great. So, oh, another health stone, uh, another two actually. So we've got like a four health stone or five, I don't remember. I mean, I mean that's insane. I mean, they are draining drain the enemy's health uh, crazily. So we are... We do not have to worry about regeneration anymore, at least at this stage of the game. More income, of course. Let's reload. Okay, we're, pre we're getting quite high income here. I mean, that's uh, great. That's great because uh, it will help us uh, survive longer. Let's get uh, this uh, normal splash tower. And let's wait a little bit because the rest of the towers are not of our interest, to be honest. Let's see what we can get now after 3 seconds. Alright, let's get much 6 and uh, maybe we can get a corrosive poison. Maybe, but I'm thinking. Let's get a splash instead. And then improve the piercing attack maybe? Hmm. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Okay, let's get the first frost bow. Because the, the slow will help uh, uh, the the creep uh, will help me slowing down the creep attack speed and help me survive longer. So we're go going to get this uh, poison skin. I mean poison armor and some regeneration. This poison armor is actually great. So this gives uh, us extra armor and uh, make us make the damage the creep can do to our tower lower. The first turn armor point uh, is really important because it de decreases linearly, I think, or exponentially. So make sure you get 5 or 10 armor in this game. And a 10 or 5 is actually enough. Okay, another health stone. Maybe you can get this this health stone. Because that's very, very, very interesting. I mean, we have uh, some gold left after we get that 10k tower, so let's get it. I mean, why not? It's just great. Health stone is uh, one of the greatest uh, uh, weapons in this game. Okay, so let's sacrifice our health regeneration and uh, inst instantly we got another 10k tower. That's great. Okay, wow, more transmute. Let's get it. And a bounty hunter. Uh, without any doubt, we're going to get it. So now the rest of towers are not uh, that uh, great. Uh, not not that powerful, so maybe it's a good idea. It's a wonderful idea to uh, be patient and uh, wait a little bit. Let's get a uh, magic coin. Maybe you can get uh, this uh, HP because we can't need the HP to survive. And let's get uh, some more additional armors. So now we can maybe reroll, maybe because those uh, weapons are not very uh, very interesting. Uh, not uh, that uh, as. Uh, Powerful as other t weapons. That's why I'm waiting. Let's wait, wait a little bit. Wow, let's get this uh, spec wheel, don't you? That's great. And now that we have uh, that uh, 10k tower, we can maybe relax a little bit. By that, I mean we can. We now we know that for sure that we are going to survive the first 10 minutes. So that's great. Maybe we can get a point of spear, I'm thinking. Hmm, okay, never mind. Let's wait and get a tower like that one. Okay, chain heal. That's great. Let's get more uh, slow and frost bow so that the enemy deal can deal lower damage to our, our tower. And let's get also get Ripple because uh, it also reduces the enemy's uh, attack speed and uh, attack damage. So with the same same ob objective uh, aim of uh, making the tower more stronger, more resilient. Let's get that uh, 
poison bomb and the toxic poisons to make the enemy get higher damage and get a wisp. Alright, we have some great, great uh, stats, so they can keep doing that. Our regeneration is pretty quite high actually. And now we are the only survivor already, but we have to push for our limits. Okay, more transmute, and let's get to that uh, chaotic spirit, which is a awesome tower. So basically, we are pretty safe here because uh, the, the enemies cannot mm, make us lose more than half of the HP. So we are very safe here. I mean, that's that's great. That's actually very very great. So let's get more gold, income and gold. And we have 20k gold already, let's reroll. Okay, more transmute. I mean, welcome. Okay, reroll, more HP, let's get some life steal, and attack speed, and some upgrades. Okay, Ballista, we're going to get Ballista. That's great, let's get a Dreadlord, Fun, and Rapid File, and Gem of Power. Let's see if we can get it. Coin, no coin, but it's okay. Let's get uh, another transmute. Wow, I don't remember how many transmute we've got here in this game. Maybe we should get a chaos region because we have uh, so many, so many. I mean, health stone and the sun chaotic spirit and the sun cripple, crippler. So let's get it. Alright, now we can actually buy whatever we want because at this point we are getting so much gold that uh, it doesn't really matter what uh, weapon you buy because you are going to have enough to buy them all. That's the, I mean, this is the stage that I think is the most satisfying stage where you just can spend the gold on anything you want, do not having to worry about uh, uh, buying other uh, more useful weapons to, in order to survive because you are going to survive anyway. All right, more transmute. Oh my god, that's insane. We should get a ballista. All right, let's get magic seeds. Point of spear. Now we can get point of spear because we we kind of skipped one point of spear. Let's see, so let's get it. Splash is also good. Mm, yeah, I think let's get it. So we have ten. 18k, 20k, wow, that's great. Okay, more towers, more 10k weapons. Landmine, okay, another landmine. And some, some armors, frost armors. So now we are, I'm actually 100% that I'm, we are kind of uh, safe here. We are kind of surviving with any, without a problem. Because we have a high HP, high armor, and that's something that you need in late game, so make sure that the creep do not uh, destroy your tower in one or two hits. So let's get more income and, and let's just buy anything that we see <laughs> here. Well, I mean, you have to consider not buying some uh, crap weapons such as, I don't know, maybe I'll tell you when I say one, but uh, yeah, but you can just play, uh, play paying less attention, I guess, I guess that's the word. You don't do not have to consider so much uh, when you make a decision because you're going to be fine. Okay, more transmute. You're going to get everything. By then all. Okay, double. Oh, double ten k tower. Double impaler. Wow, that's something you do not usually see. Let's get them. Okay, a crippler in, and uh, we bought all the <laughs> upgrades and the weapons. Let's get this master crafted masonry and uh, some more weapons. Wow, chain here, another one. Of course, we're going to buy it. We can also get a splash fire, which increases the splash damage. Alright, 
so landmines are working great another ballista and more po more poison bone it's a reroll okay frost armor make sure that uh, we have a high armor and high high hp now we can get to the lane generator it's which is not a recommended i mean a few minutes ago but now it doesn't matter you can just get it you can get it you may just get as many towers as possible because the rerolling rerolling cost is pretty high so one reroll may be cost the price of one tower i mean so why reroll when you can spend it go to uh, buying weapons so that's the thing here you have to take into account okay so we have a pretty high income. Look at that. We have a 166 income. That's just something very, very, very crazy here. Okay, now the poison. Get uh, all the weapons and the upgrades. Another poison spear. Should I get it? Nah. It's a uh, reroll. Okay. Blaster. And. Uh, Get everything. Just get everything. Thorn. Now we. Okay. Just play careful. Nah. Just buy. Let's just buy everything. We have enough gold. I mean, yeah. Okay. Another spec wheel launcher. So it's interesting that uh, we are just uh, killing the creeps. Uh, and the creeps are, are not even attacking me. Although we have a very high HP and uh, armor and uh, life, life regeneration, but the creepy are not able to attack me. I mean, maybe one of them can hit me once, once in a while. while but uh, that's just uh, that's nothing to me. That's uh, they deal some damage, but uh, our high regeneration speed just uh, recover the damage in a very short amount of time. So we are just actually like invincible here. But now we keep buying. Just buy engineering upgrade, <laughs> which is uh, a fun upgrade to buy at this point. Uh, so we do not have many 500 gold weapons, but it's okay. So we, are we have to close to 200 income. I mean, that's uh, I mean, one, like one of the highest income I've uh, I've gotten. So that's that's great. All right. So let's get a splash uh, more. Let's just get, get everything. So you can see around uh, my tower there is uh, a bunch of uh, landmines. So that uh, means that uh, the creeps are not even getting closer, more than 300 range to our tower, which says a lot about uh, our damage. I mean, the damage are so high that the even the new spawn creep cannot get closer than 300 range that's just crazy the ins the the insane high damage that uh, our weapon are dealing let's get a renew so we have some insane also regeneration here okay okay no took tower board but we're going to buy them um, anyway because as I said, it does not uh, matter any anymore. It's not important which tower you choose. You just uh, buy everything because you have uh, enough gold. And uh, your tower you buy because of the upgrades you have uh, been buying are going to deal great damage. Look at that. <laughs> 1200 regeneration. That's just insane. Okay, so gold wagon. And a little help to to our match, but uh, not uh, necessarily important. And uh, they are they were not needed, but uh, some extra gold are also welcome, uh, always welcome. So now we just can buy more things, more weapons upgrades. At this point, I think that uh, because of the combination of uh, different debuff and buff effects, you your upgrades have been given to you. So you are basically invincible. No tower, no units can kill you, can hit you anymore. I mean, you have reached the final stage of the game, where you become uh, kind of invincible. 
So yeah, let's just uh, get everything we we want. And uh, as I said, I, as, as I have said earlier, there is no difference in buying one tower or buying other you know, another tower because uh, you are going to do just perfect, perfectly fine here. All right, we're close. It's close to 20 minutes. So what will happen at 20 minutes? Let's see. Oh, uh, so excited! Oh, here's the boss. Samwise here. Whoa, that's climbing high, but he cannot not hit me. Oh, that's he. Okay, 